Hey guys! Welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be a Divisoria haul. And I'm also going to show to you guys some of the products that I got which are not from Divisoria. So, halo-halo to guys. Before we proceed, I just want to thank my boyfriend, Eugene, for being so supportive in everything that I do. Kahit alam niya na puro girly stuff lang naman yung bibilin ko sa Divisoria, still, sinamahan pa rin niya ako. So, I really appreciate it and thank you so much. Anyway guys, let's get on to the haul video. item that I bought is actually this shirt right here. So, ito siya. This is actually a couple shirt. So, pati si Eugene meron din ito. Another couple shirt is this polo right here. So, kulay red din siya, guys. Next is this chokers. Sobrang uso ng mga chokers ngayon, guys. I don't know why, pero... Dahil makikiuso ako, bumili ako nito. I got five different designs. And yung isa kasi binuksan ko na. Ito yung itatry ko ngayon. So, ayan siya guys. Hindi ko alam kung maluwag siya kasi maliit yung leeg ko. But anyway, ayoko naman na mas masikip pa siya dyan. So, these are the other styles that I got. Ito yung style niya. Ito naman siya guys. Triangle shape siya na may crystal sa gitna. And ito... Merong heart dito, tas meron parang raindrop, tas eto may love na nakasulat. So, eto yung next, guys. Lace yung style niya, tapos sa gitna meron siyang pendant na music note. These are the silicone sponges. Dalawa na yung kinuha ko, guys, dahil 45 pesos each lang naman. So, mura na yun. Ang dami ko nang nakikita ang ganito, guys, at naintriga ako, kaya gusto ko siyang subukan. And eto, ang lambot niya, parang siyang jelly. Ang sarap niya kagatin. No. No. Ipigilan ko yung sarili ko, guys. And I also got this bag right here. Ayan. 150 pesos lang to, guys. Pero ang ganda niya. It looks so classy. It looks very elegant. Saro siyang gold chain. Tapos ito yung hawakan niya. If you want it na sling bag. Pag gamit mo na siya, hindi na siya mukhang galing divisoria. Oh, diba? Cute. And I also got this Velcro brushes. So, 20 pesos lang to doon, guys. Ang mura. Ito may yung kinawa ko, guys. And it looks something like this. Babrush mo lang siya pagilid. There. O, oh, ba? Pwede ka na mag-makeup. Then, I also got the Sandy Pin Puff. Look at ito, guys. So, it looks something like this. And yung hawakan niya may nakalagay na Sandy Pin sa likod. Okay din siya sa under eyes. ba? Yan. This is the Sandy Pin Compact Puff. Ang lalambot ng mga sponges na to, guys. Ang sarap niyang kagatin. Parang marshmallow to. And I'm going to use this pag magbe-bake na ako ng face. Next is the Glad King Professional Brush Guards. So, yung isang ganto guys, meron siyang 15 pieces. Dapat pala dalawa na lang yung kinuha ko, no? But anyway, yun din yung pangalan ng store kung saan ko nabili yung mostly ng mga products dito, guys. Dahil ang mamura din naman dun. Next is the Full Lips Lip Enhancer. Nakita ko na rin to sa ibang YouTubers, guys. At naintriga ako, so gusto ko siyang itry. So, it looks something like this. And ito yung likod niya. So, parang lalagyan mo siya dyan in front of your lips and then you have to suck it in. Anyway, gagamitin ko to kahit sabi nila malaki na daw yung lips ko. Uso naman, ba? Ito talaga yung pinuntahan ko dun eh. These are the Taiwan False Eyelashes. So, I got three. This is 42S, guys. I don't know if you guys can see, pero meron siyang purple na strand sa kanya. Ang cute nito, guys. And hindi naman siya ganun kakapal, so okay lang to sa akin. This one naman is 216. Ito siya, guys. Natural looking lang din yung mga lashes na to, guys. Ito talaga yung mga magagamit ko. Mas prefer ko kasi natural looking kaysa yung mga makakapal na lashes. One of the reasons is hindi ako comfortable maglagay ng false eyelashes. Kaya ito muna yung kinuha ko yung mga maninipis lang. And then this one is 217. Maninipis lang din to, guys. Ano bang difference dito? Ito naman, guys. Mas mahaba lang yung lashes na ng konti kaysa dun sa 216. Pero still natural looking pa din. Pag pumunta kayo dun guys, magsawa kayo sa lashes and sa magagandang brushes. These are the premium eyebrow razors. 
So, dalawa na siya, guys. 80 pesos lang to, guys. So, okay na din yun. And ganda yung itsura niya. I think okay naman na to for its price. At alam niyo na, guys, it caught my attention because of the color. Hindi ko na maalala yung prices ng iba, guys. Pero sure naman, guys, na mura lang talaga dun. Compare kung sa ibang lugar mo sila pipilin or sa malls. Ganyan. So, okay na din. I also got a set of oval brushes. So, meron ka ng 5 brushes in here. Ang cute niya dahil gold yung handle niya. So, these are the brushes. Okay naman siya, guys. And, look. It's very dense. If I'm not mistaken, this one is for contour. Ganyan mo siya, oh. Diba? Madali na lang mag-apply. Bumababa yung choker, guys, dahil maliit talaga yung leit ko. But, anyway, adjust-adjust pag may time. <laughs> this is the last product I bought from Divisoria. This is the Real Techniques Sam Spix Brushes. I think yung mga brushes naman sa Divisoria, okay naman sila. I mean, the application of your makeup will not be compromised. Ayan, no. Malambot naman yung brush, guys. As always, you have to clean this before you use it for the first time. And you also have to clean this once a month at least. Depende kung gano'n mo kadalas ginagamit yung mga brushes mo, guys. I got some products from Humming Plus, the Skin Breath. First is this BB Cream. So, kung tama yung pagkakaalala ko, guys, 150 pesos to, tatlo na. And nung dinemo sa akin to, okay siya kasi pinkish tone siya. And fresh, natural looking lang yung mukha ko. And sabi ng sales lady, long-lasting naman to. So, hindi mo na kailangan ng retail. This has whitening properties and SPF 30 PA++ and each sachet contains 2.5 grams of product. Yung isa kasi guys, nabuksan ko na eh. Ginamit ko na siya. So far, okay naman to guys. So, this is a makeup base which provides a long-lasting coverage without clogging the pores. Then, I also got the Green Tea Peeling Gel Face Scrub. Ito naman, 130 pesos yung 3 sachets. And each sachet has 7 grams of product. Meron din tong whitening properties and meron na din siyang moisturizer. And dinemo na din sa akin to, pero hindi ko pa alam kung magugustuhan ko siya. But anyway, I think this is also worth trying naman. Pumili ako ng gantong brush, guys. Ang tawag nila dito is mushroom brush. Nakikita ko na din to sa ibang YouTubers and I think okay naman din to gamitin pang apply ng foundation. Hindi naman naglalagas yung bristles niya and malambot naman siya. It also comes with this brush guard. And I bought this for 200 pesos. I also got this kind of brush. So, ito pwede siyang pang contour. Ganyan. Ito, 200 pesos din to guys eh. And ito naman na bili ko sa labas. Braid. Braided hair. So, ilalagay mo siya ganyan. Hindi ako sure kung bagay sa akin guys, but... Ayan, nakita na ko, so binili ko na din siya. Arte-arte lang. At ito. Guys, hindi ako bumili ng makeup products sa Divisoria dahil hindi ko alam kung safe pa siya or kung anong chemical yung meron sa mga products na yun. But I do not discourage you guys. Kung gusto nyo itry mga makeup products doon, go ahead guys. You are really free to do so. And meron din naman akong napanood na YouTube videos na gamit yung mga Divisoria makeup products and I think okay naman. But for me, merong risk yung paggamit ng mga makeup products from Divisoria. That's just my opinion guys. Anyway guys, yun na yung mga products na nabili ko sa Divisoria. And then, ito namang mga papakita ko sa inyo. These are from Detail Makeover. Ito nabili ko sa Victory Central Mall sa May Monumento. And nandun siya sa stall ng Cosmetics Unlimited. I'm going to start with a contour and blush palette. You have a bronzer. You have the highlighter. And you also have the blushes. You have two blushes in here. So this is what it looks like guys. Tada! So, sa taas, merong instructions ng applications ng bawat isa dito. Meron din silang tips dito sa baba. Okay naman guys, pigmented naman sila. Isa to sa best sellers nila dun. And it's not that expensive guys. I bought this for 450 pesos. I also got this detail lip scrub. Ito pang exfoliate ng lips. So, it looks something like this. Ganda yung itsura ng actual product niya guys. Na-try ko na to guys and okay naman siya pag ginamit mo. Malambot yung lips mo after mo siya gamitin. Pwede mo siyang punasan lang ng tissue or pwede mo na yung hugasan. I think naka-sale to. This is 99 pesos. And if I'm not mistaken, yung original price is 199. This has 5 grams of product. 
I also got the matte in detail in the shade D10 or Rhea. So this is what it looks like. Ang ganda ng kulay niya, guys. Sorry kung hindi ako magaling mag-describe ng color, pero maganda siya. And actually, itatry ko siya. Sinwatch ko lang to, guys, pero hindi ko pa siya nagamit. Medyo dry siya sa lips, pero kasi sabi ng sales lady, mag-exfoliate daw muna ako ng lips bago ko to i-apply. And hindi ko siya nagawa ngayon, pero okay naman siya. Medyo sticky lang. And I also got the Detail Make Brow Mascara. This is in the shade Blonde. And ito yung binigay sa akin kasi sabi nila bagay daw to sa kulay ng hair ko. So it looks something like this. And yung wad niya, ganito. So, ito yung kulay niya, guys. Waterproof to, guys, eh. Pinakita sa akin. And hindi rin siya nag-smudge. This is the Detail Makeover Liquid Eyeliner and Eyebrow Pen. This is in the shade DD3. On this side, you have eyeliner. So, that's it for this haul video, guys. I hope you enjoyed watching. I will be listing down all the products I've mentioned in the description box down below. And if you guys like this video, kindly give it a thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. You can also click that tiny bell button so you will be notified of my future videos. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on my next video. Bye guys!